Never go front. Oh my gosh. Are you serious? Is it missing a button? Nope, the button's there. I love this. Okay. So this is a definite. I see a size 22 top. Who is it? <laughs> Ashley Stewart. Oh, it's a jacket. It's a jacket. Okay. All right. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's be neat. All right, let's be neat. Okay. And Taylor, because we're looking for vintage. More designer, Derek Hart girl. What's this? Cats. Ooh, hold on, what size is this? Petite medium. You guys know I love black and white. But in my size, of course. Cardigans. Turtlenecks. Really looking for unique prints. What, what's this? This is vintage. It's nice. It's missing a button. But I like it. I like the color pattern. I like the colorway. Uh, Let's put that back. And I had guest jeans. Greg Norman. This is unique. Oh, it's got some stains. It's got some stains. Cachet. The New Republic is not the Merino. How do we feel about this, guys? Hmm. I kind of love it. Does it have too much wear, though? You know what? Let's put it right here. Let's think about it as we move through the section. Oh, that's pretty. Vintage blouse. I like the draping on it. I think about it. Uh, oh. Okay. No. Oh, it's fighting me, guys. It's fighting me. Hello, my guys. Okay, so you saw a little bit of a shop with me at Pavarello Center, Pavarello Thrift Store. I always want to call it Pavarello Center because they have. A, um, a food bank here in Fort Lauderdale, but I went to the Pavarello thrift store, thrift store, that British keeps coming out, <laughs> the Pavarello thrift store in Pompano. I'm trying to venture out. I'm trying to, you know, see different things. Let's see what's going on around Broward County. Um, I'll be venturing south pretty soon, but we did a little bit of a shop with me. Let me show you what I actually did purchase, and I've got a really fantastic find, which I'm so excited to show you guys. <coughs> Excuse me. But first things first. Um, there was a lot there. There was a lot to go through. Um, and when I mean a lot, I don't mean like a goodwill a lot. Just there was a lot of everything kind of mixed in and jumbled together. Um, so this is going to seem kind of like leather and then denim and then da da da. Um, so the first piece that I got, um, I love this. I freaking love these. These are some leather pants, but I can you tell, like, I want you to kind of see, like, the detailing on the front. It's like a gaucho leather pant. Um, it's a vintage leather pant. It's a size 14. I know my 12 and 14s. You guys have been looking for me, honey. Coming for me real hard. This is by Tox. Um, and it's just like a gaucho leather pant. Really cool. Um, as you can see, like you see where the crotch is, it's all the way down here. So it's supposed to kind of give you like a voluminous kind of thing going on around the hip area and then narrow at the leg. And I know for some of you, you're like, oh my God, that's horrible. <laughs> Not if you know how to wear it right. 
And so because you're following me <laughs> and you're adventurous with your style, my girls who know how to wear this know how to wear this. It'd kind of be high-waisted. That's what I'm imagining because the crotch is so low. Like the rise, this has to be about a 14-inch rise. And so I'm thinking it's going to be high-waisted and then kind of go out at the hip. But yeah, so this is the 14. I really love, whenever I see stuff like this, I'm just like, you know, I do love a YSL or a Salon, I should say. I do love a Salon, but there's just something about when you find leather and it's vintage and it's the same look. So this, I don't know who this is going to fit. I really wanted this to fit me. Um, oh, the bag just fell. Um, hold on. Okay. Are we good? Are we good? All right. So I really wanted this to fit me, but of course it's not. So this is a romper, but can you see? Oh, there you go. You see the design of it? It is a romper and it's very long leg. So this, you have to be about five, nine, unless you want to, um, you see how long the leg is? Oh my gosh. But just a vintage romper. I don't know how I'm going to put this this is not going to go on the mannequin. I don't exactly know how I'm going to take a picture of this. Um, yeah, I'll figure it out though. But it's a really beautiful all-in-one black romper. You can see the design of it there. <sighs> this skirt, Pendleton, size 18. I was really excited about this. I don't really find Pendleton a lot. A lot of people do, but I do not. Um, so here we go, Pendleton. You can see the design of the bottom. Um, let's see this let's see can you tell yes okay so I was really worried because I didn't know if the colorway would come out you could see the blue and the peach in there so just this buttoned all wrong but <laughs> buttoned all types of wrong but this is just a vintage cardigan you know whenever I see something color blocked or just something with a slight bit of color, especially when it has, as you can see, the more color you have, I feel like you can pair it with, you know, with, with this, I can put it with all types of stuff, right? Um, so there we go, that looks better. That looks better. So you can wear it with blue, you can do it with peach, you can definitely color mix this or pattern mix this because it does have the two colors there. And then, oh, I got this, I, I keep on picking up these capelets. This is like an Asian brand. Um, but this is a capelet. I think everybody needs a capelet. This is kind of like what we Florida girls wear <laughs> with jeans. The little capelets. So I got that. Like I said, you see how it went from like vintage to capelet? I'm not going to keep this. I know that you guys are probably looking at me in this video like, Dion, please put that on posh. Look at this sweater, guys. Can't you see this is my vibe? <laughs> I could probably wear this over this. Um, wouldn't that be crazy? Double sweater day. Um, but oh, I love this. I just absolutely adore this. My girls, my girls who dress like me. <laughs> you catch the vibe. I know you do. Um, and then we have this piece. You know what I'm saying? Like, you see what I'm saying? It's like, and that's new with tags, Violet and Claire. Is that what it's called? Um, Violet and Claire, TJ Maxx. Some of you probably just donated it from their closet. You see what I'm saying? It's kind of like all over the place. It's kind of like vintage, leather, sweater, tank top. So, of course, this is something that would go underneath a sweater. Probably. Ooh, look at the Holy Ghost. This is me. Look at that. Probably under that. Because this is a medium, and then this is a extra large. But a fast fashion extra large, probably like a large. All right, bag number two. So this one needs some rubbing. This is a leather skirt, but it does have some mold marks on it. So I'm gonna have to wipe it down, warm water and vinegar. But I like the shape of it. I like the shape of it. Um. Okay, I know you're gonna be like, Dion, what the heck were you doing? I don't understand. I, I don't understand. So because I use, well, I've had, I've had every hairstyle in the book, okay? But because I have the short hair, I'm always 
you know, when I see stuff like this, I'm like, oh, that looks like me. <laughs> this is not for me, of course, but I'm saying, my girls with the short haircuts and the red lips, I was like, ooh, what a funky sweater. I was like, that looks like me. So I got it. <laughs> but isn't that funky? Like if you have short hair and a red lip and you put that on, it's like, oh, that's me. That's the way my brain thinks. Okay, so this was totally like, uh, not an impulse buy, but like a, a brand to watch or a brand that I used, not brand to watch, but a brand that I used to carry just because cut for, cut for cloth. It's not, it, um, it's not selling like it used to, but it's one of those things where I'm, you know, I just got it. I got it to get it. Okay. Don't judge me, but boyfriend jean, and I got it because it was a size 12 and you guys know I'm working on my 10 to 14s within my Poshmark closet. So there's cut for cloth. Okay. This dress. <laughs> this is Peggy Bundy all day long. Let me tell you what. Let me tell you why this is Peggy Bundy. So this is just a like you know I feel I feel a house dress, okay? And I love the pattern of the dress. I just feel like this is just I just love the pattern of it. But you know what made me buy it? Was this cigarette hole? <laughs> I know it's crazy, but I was like, oh my gosh, that adds character. <laughs> Pray for me, okay? Pray for me. But I saw this and I, I was like, oh, this looks like a regular little house dress. But then I saw the cigarette hole and I was like, oh, I have to get it. I have to get it. So my cigarette hole will be up on posh. This is a pair of suede. These are size 14. Um, just size 14 suede pants. Can never have too much of that. I can never do these pants. They don't have enough gift for me. I really want to, but it's not on my body type. Um, oh, this is Sheen. This is actually a company that I will be working with. You're gonna see a video very soon, Sheen. So look at the front. Let me show the front first. Let me show the front, and then let me show you the back. See that? Isn't that beautiful? So Sheen is a fast fashion brand. Um, I actually wore Sheen to Puerto Rico this past summer, if you remember. Um, I had a lot of Sheen pieces and I did kind of like a, um, uh, uh, not a lookbook, but like I kind of brought you in, through the packing process of packing all my stuff. And so this is a Sheen dress. So I thought it was so beautiful. I love the color. And again, I love the back. Maybe because I want to be one of those women that don't have to wear a bra. I don't know who's not going to be wearing a bra back here, but you know, I'm a hater. <laughs> I'm a hater in that sense. Um, and then I got this, this is a 3X. I got this because I don't know, hold on. So this is the front, right? This is the front, it's by a brand, Moonlight YNS Fashion Design. So this is the front, you guys can see, oh, you guys can see right here, you guys can see that going on right there. But I was like, oh, I would love to wear let this be the front because I have that same little thing and you have the pockets and the I mean the buttons in the back um I like this as the front so yeah this is going up on posh um because I, I don't need another white top I me and white don't get along at all all right so the last piece that I want to show you is actually something I'm really excited about let me insert this picture and then it'll kind of give you insight as to why I'm so excited about this piece Okay, so I was walking out of the store and I saw, this is so freaking heavy guys, I saw this jacket and I was like, oh my gosh, it looks like YSL, Balenciaga, Acme, all the brands are coming out with this jacket in their version, but this is actually like a true vintage, this is so heavy guys. But I was, I was, I was in love. So I was thinking it could fit me, but it could not. Um, but it's so, I think it's like a 40, no, it says, I don't know what that says. But yeah, I saw this and it reminded me, there's a, a vlogger that I, that I adore. She's an name Claire. 
Um, Chupet? Chupet? Chupet. Chupet. Yes. Um, but she lives and dies by these types of jackets. And Topshop, everybody has a version of these. Every store has a version of these. But I saw it and I was like, oh. So it's going up in posh. So yeah, like instead of, you know, 2,000, 3,000, it'd be like 100 or 200, right? Yeah, I love this. I love this. Somebody release this in the, from the closet. All right. So that is it. I enjoyed the experience. I love going to Pavarello, period. I love the vibe of the place. Um, it's just a happy thrift store and everybody's joyful and it's just the customer service is amazing. So I'll definitely be back. Um, they do have, like I said, a mish, mishmash of things. And so if you go in there, you just have to know exactly what your vibe is. And if you're shopping for yourself, you have to know like what you're looking for because there's a lot to kind of sort through. But I definitely give it two thumbs up. All right. Love you. We never pay retail. The stuff will be listed on Poshmark at Dion Dean. Um, yeah. Let me get to cleaning, steaming, measuring, listing, all that good stuff. All right. Bye. Thank you.